Hi everybody, I'm sitting here with Cobra from Cobra and the Lotus uh, from Canada. Nice to be here with you. Thank you. How do you feel today? Ah, uh, great. Yeah, good to go. Yeah. Um, now you are on tour with Evergrey and Delane. Is it your first time here in Munich or? Yeah, this is our first time in Munich. And yeah, we know tour life is um, stressful. One day, one city. Um, do you have any time left for sightseeing, um, especially in such beautiful and historical cities like Vienna or Munich? Unfortunately, no. And when we have a rest day, I usually spend it resting. So I haven't really seen very much. Oh, yeah. Aww. But it makes me uh, create lists in my head for places I want to go and spend time in, you know, when I'm not on tour. Yeah, yeah. Because I still love to travel. <laughs> yeah, then it's a good opportunity to yeah. take a little look at the cities. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, how is the chemistry between the bands um, on this tour? And did you know the bands before? Uh, I knew of the bands, but I didn't know what they sounded like, really. Um, but the chemistry has been great. It's a really versatile bill. It's very musically uh, versatile, which you'll see tonight. And I think that's really cool. Mm -hmm. Everyone is heavy and rock or metal in their own way. Okay. And uh, we're sharing a bus with Evergrey. Mm -hmm. And they've been awesome. Yeah, great. Sounds great. Um, your next album, Pre Whale, will be out soon. Will you play some new songs tonight? Two new songs, actually. Ooh, great. Uh, uh, that's one third of our set, since our set is 30 minutes. Two songs <laughs> is a lot of <laughs> our set. <laughs> But it, it will be really fun. We've been enjoying playing two new tracks. Okay, great. We are excited. Yeah. <laughs> Um, you finance your upcoming album the, via pledge music. Do you think this is the modern way how bands um, should handle it? Or do you still see the um, label and responsibility? Uh, I still think that it always helps to have a label or someone that is helping to support the band and push the band with publicity. But pledge music, I think, is brilliant because I think people that support the music love to be a part of the process and yeah. creating it and in that sense uh you're really working together which i think makes it kind of special actually yeah, so i i i like it for that reason yeah yeah um and yeah there is also the profits for profit for the fans right yeah because it's it's they they can be near to the bands um, and yeah. which they will um support absolutely Great. <laughs> so let's come back to the tour. Um, lots of your tour dates are in the United Kingdom. Is it a coincidence or um, do you have a bigger fan community there than um, in the other, uh, other European countries? Uh, I think they just put everything all together mm -hmm. on their tour. Um, we've been, I believe, just as much in Germany on this tour. Uh, there's been a lot of German dates. Uh, I think it's just because they're covering everything. Oh, okay. But we as a band, Cobra and the Lotus, has the most fans in the UK. Okay. But it's good for us to be out around in Europe so that yeah. we can be exposed. A lot of people uh, in some cities said, oh, I didn't know you existed. Is this your first time here? And we were like, no, this is our fourth time oh. here, but no one knows. <laughs> Oh. So it's good, it's good. <laughs> yeah, you collect more fans. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's good just to uh, get your, your sound out there to new people. Mm -hmm. Great. Um, if you take a look in the past, um, what was the funniest thing that happened to you on a tour? Oh, uh, well, we played a really special tour with uh, Kiss and Def Leppard. It was very big and... It was amphitheaters, and on the very last, second last show, the Def Leppard crew started taking everything off the stage and disassembling the kit while we were playing the last song. Oh. <laughs> and we didn't know what was happening because we never had a tour prank played on us before, so we're all looking at each other like, are we over time? What's happening <laughs> right now? People are looking in the audience like, what the heck? <laughs> Uh, Brad's like playing bass. He has his foot on a monitor. They come and take the monitor out from under his foot. Oh, no. And by the end, there was just uh, the snare and the kick drum and the hi-hat. 
everything else gone yeah great just yeah. taking one symbol off at a time every drum yeah <laughs> sounds funny and horrible it, it was uh really funny really funny <laughs> i can imagine yeah. um in five years is there one band you would like to go on tour with oh um oh there's so many bands i would love to tour with I mean, I still think it would be great to tour with Iron Maiden. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of yeah, but uh, there's a lot of really cool bands uh, out there. I would really like to do a tour with um, Alter Bridge. Uh huh. Yeah, and uh, endless. I, I don't. I couldn't really give you a, it's a list yeah like, yeah like it would be a pleasure to tour with uh, really any band that's doing their thing out there yeah yeah let's hope that it will be um iron maiden or alter bridge in the future <laughs> <laughs> ah. um so let's concentrate on your music which artists did you and your music influence the most mm. um right now there's not really specific influences they're coming from all genres as well just to diversify the ideas that can come into my brain mm -hmm. and uh, my heart started with Led Zeppelin and Fleetwood Mac it was actually in 70s classic rock mm -hmm. uh, and then it developed into yeah. metal <laughs> um, and then you know there was Judas Priest which is what inspired my first album but that was 11 years ago when i started to write those oh, songs really early yeah <laughs> so now i i just enjoy so many different things i really enjoy uh, uh folky things um there's a lot of swedish artists i've been getting into like okay. lars wienerback and um uh i really like devon townsend mm -hmm. um <laughs> yeah it, it's just really it's really diverse i'm really enjoying evergrey Uh, I love their sound. This, okay. is, this was a, a new find for me coming on tour with them, and I really dig it. It's like heavy, heavy rock with some atmosphere. It's cool. Yeah, sounds great. Yeah. I'm really excited. Yeah, yeah, you should be. It's yeah. gonna be great. Yeah, I, I hope <laughs> I've so. seen it. It's gonna be great. Okay. <laughs> I believe you. Yeah. Um, Are there any artists or bands um, where we are thinking about working um, together with, for example, for one song or maybe um, an album? Yeah, it would be great to do an album with some different artists down the road. Uh, hopefully I'll, I will get to do some work with Camelot. Mm -hmm. We'll see what happens, though. Um, I really enjoyed touring with them. So uh, it was fun to sing their songs and yeah. be the just the, the ghost, the female ghost. <laughs> so that would be nice. And then, uh, huh, I think it would be really cool to do something with um, In Flames or something like that, like to have a, a growler like yeah. from In Flames or, um, yeah, I don't know. This is, this is a loaded question. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you yeah. know, you know, <laughs> yeah, 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 of course. I'd really like to sing with the uh, Brent, the singer of Shine Down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's just those like thousands of gifted musicians out there. Yeah, yeah, of yeah. Course. So um, I've got one last question for you. <laughs> yeah, cats or dogs? Which are the better pets? <laughs> oh, this is so easy for me. <laughs> I am a dog person. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you have a dog? Yeah. Um, I don't have dogs because I'm gone too much, but my family has three. Ah, oh, and great. I've grown up with them, and I just absolutely adore them. Uh, <laughs> cats, I don't trust them, so <laughs> I don't know what they're thinking. I think they're manipulative. <laughs> they can be really cute and then they do it to get what they want and I don't like it <laughs> <laughs> I know what you mean yeah 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 so I'm more of like dogs I guess they're more like my personality you know <laughs> I'm they're totally loyal <laughs> they are not so needy and they do their their thing and they're there for you yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah good answer <laughs> so yeah thank you for your time um, we are really excited and wish you a great show tonight. Oh, thank you very much. Thanks. <laughs>